Hi soldiers Good morning Good afternoon and good evening Welcome to Now Experts Time channel In this channel we have a various topics discussed in the earlier videos So if you want to explore those item please subscribe and stay tuned with this channel and refer those videos and understand a uh, few items the niche items from the service now side i hope you will enjoy so in today's uh, session what we are going to discuss is service portfolio management so why we should study this service portfolio management uh, where this service portfolio management is supporting definitely this question will come to answer this question so how many people you have uh, seen like a uh, two fields from your each uh, table that is that is called a service field and service offering so when you refer an incident or problem or change or service request whatever it is so there you can see the service and service offering uh, fields so behind these two fields what is a logic uh, height in service now side to derive this logic service now introduced to the concept called a service portfolio management so this service portfolio management it is a supporting to derive your service service offering related uh, uh, informations or logic in your business landscape this is one area and uh, another area uh, maybe you hear the same word into the csdm model so csdm common service data model version 1 2 3 4 5 uh, there is a um, name highlighted called uh, service offering technical offering so those are all the name normally you have seen in this uh, diagrammatic representation right so to derive this service offering to derive this business services those area this service portfolio management is playing a vital role so this service portfolio management if you are introducing then the service portfolio management you should transform as a digital portfolio management as well yeah so first thing is what is service portfolio management second thing is what is the difference between the service portfolio management and digital portfolio management so those items you are clear then uh, you will get more clarity how to apply this solution in our business landscape so first we will see the portfolio management uh, how many portfolios are currently available in service now landscape so i personally feel totally five portfolios are there these five five portfolios i have specified here service portfolio management project portfolio management application portfolio management strategic portfolio management and digital portfolio management so the, these are all the five different products we are using in service now uh, landscape so when we talk about this service portfolio management these three are associated that means red color highlighted service portfolio project portfolio and digital portfolio these are all the three having a relation sip and if you see the below uh, what are all the major capabilities are associated in this each portfolio that's what i have highlighted in this below area when you talk about this service portfolio there are four major layer uh, service portfolios taxonomy services and service offerings are there so these four it is helping to derive that service and service offering fields from your incident table number 1 number 2 is csdm model alignment also it is supporting specifically you can see the offering these areas it is supporting in this service portfolio management this service portfolio management it it cannot run uh, independently it is depending the project portfolio management because based on your idea projects demands Uh, portfolio lens then it is supporting this service portfolio management area next digital portfolio management is uh, specifically uh, it's a next component next component of your service portfolio management okay i can showcase you the difference uh, where we can focus service portfolio where we can showcase in the digital uh, portfolio 
next slide will help you may uh, you can understand very clear manner this is a difference between the service portfolio and digital portfolio management uh, area uh, i personally feel the, the, these are all the four major difference uh, i can see the service portfolio and digital portfolio uh, when you talk a service portfolio it is completely rely uh, rely with the it services and operational uh, services and a digital portfolio uh, it's a digitalized and the business related transformations uh, it is uh, supporting this is a one line word but if you see the below three item it is uh, giving you more clarity what is mean by digital and business transformation what is mean by it services and operational area so focus it is clear next users who who are all going to use this portfolio management area if you talk about the service portfolio it users service managers itsm personas they are going to use this service portfolios the digital portfolios it is supporting for your product owners business leaders those personas mostly they are going to use this digital portfolio and the alignment is this alignment is applicable for your it life cycle specifically you take a demand financial planning etc so these are all comes under your service portfolio but when you are talk about this digital portfolio uh, you want to prioritize your investment you want to prepare a road map for a next one year or next six months so those areas it is playing a vital role in the digital portfolio management side and uh, how we can achieve this uh, portfolios uh, in the business landscape these are all the channels it is specifically supporting one is a service catalog mostly the service portfolio service means we are providing some support to the requesters correct so that service portfolio mostly it's a catalog driven services from service now side so this service catalog and cost op optimization these things it is supporting as a channels uh, to derive your service portfolio management and uh, digital portfolio it is supporting for your roadmap and uh, roi analysis areas it is supporting this digital uh, portfolio management area so these are all the two use cases i feel uh, it is applicable in your service portfolio and digital portfolio uh, justify cast and show how services enable in the digital wins yes this is a common pattern for all business there is no segregation for the each domain so this this use case is applicable across all business units you can take it second also it is applicable business demands and the reprior reprioritize your it services if this is a problem statement this problem statement can be derived with this help of this service portfolio and digital portfolio combination so i believe you got little clarity but when you go uh, next slides when you go a uh, real time theoretical is a practical demo then you will understand that item very clear manner but the solution where finally it is meeting very simple that service field and service offering field from your incident table or problem table or change table so uh, those area it is coming so if those fields it having a relevant information you can identify how many tickets created for this services how many people provided last month how many people provided these services to the requester so those type of questions it will be answered so catalog driven services or a uh, record producer uh, related services whatever it is it can be solving your service portfolio and digital part portfolio related solutions next i want to enable uh, service portfolio management so before going to talk more about service portfolio management service portfolio management uh, it's a uh, clubbed or merged with your digital portfolio management uh, earlier there is a separate uh, license earlier there is a separate uh, uh, module so they have uh, service now provided that but now when you purchasing the digital portfolio management itself the service portfolio management it is coming so uh, there is there is a, a larger functionalities are available to enable service portfolio and digital portfolio in your business landscape so first course of action you focus your service portfolio and you convert that service portfolio as a digital portfolio so we will go on we will discuss one by one maybe you will get more clarity there when you talk about the service portfolio or digital portfolio uh, this four layer it's a pretty much important layer one is a portfolio second is a taxonomy and third one is a service and fourth one is a service offering so these four it is supporting uh, 
to derive your portfolio that means service portfolio and digital portfolio related solution what is that <coughs> you provided that layer what is that it's very very simple to understand this item if you take a portfolio means we have a number of portfolio right in our it section we have a financial portfolio we have a uh, procurement portfolio we have a it services portfolio so we have a, everything segregated as like a group group right it services is one group procurement is like one group financial is one group so procurement related items everything it will go for the procurement portfolio it related services like it tickets related it problems related it will comes under your it related portfolio so uh, we are grouping here based on the grouping we are nominating one representative that means portfolio owner so if something it is not happening something it is not progressing very good manner that means the portfolio owner you can easily reach and you can get support to resolve those problems so each portfolio it's like a, uh, we have a separate owner so portfolio related owner it will uh, will support you to resolve your problems so portfolio i hope you are clear so combination of your all problems under in one umbrella and we name in maybe name it as a different different uh, umbrella like uh, it services financial services and procurement services so based on that your problem is segregated and it will be solved with the help of your respective personas next in the portfolio we have a taxonomy for example if you talk about the it services most of the tickets it will come uh, like a uh, software related tickets or hardware related tickets or network related tickets we don't know so we can we can derive the taxonomy so when you talk this taxonomy can you connect this taxonomy word somewhere in service now uh, uh, mod module or service now uh, capability yes this taxonomy option we are connecting with your employee central portal so same how we were uh, preparing the taxonomy similar type of taxonomy notes we are going to create in this portfolio as well so this taxonomy word you can relate your employee central portal what type of activity it is performing the same type of activity it is performing in your portfolio taxonomy as well next services so we need to provide some services right so that services what services uh, uh, how we can achieve this service so service service is a it's not an independent component it's a dependent component with your service offering service offering and service both can act uh, uh, one component one element uh, to understand purpose i have segregated here so to get a services uh, we need some uh, channel the channel called a service offering the service offering can be achievable uh, with the help of your catalog item okay so everything it is coming top to down uh, top to downstream here this service offering this service offering it is derived with the help of catalog item very simple so catalog item you already know how to develop the catalog item if you use a catalog item how the problem it is resolved you know the life cycle so i don't want to go there so <clears throat> if catalog items are there that catalog item is mapping with this service offering and this service offering it is mapping with the service and this service it is mapping with this particular taxonomy and this taxonomy it is mapping with your particular portfolio down to top approach so in understanding purpose you just go for one two three four but when you are executing the uh, solution so that time it will start from four three two one so that's the way it will work so how i have explained portfolio it having a owner similar way service also we have a owner some services is not functioning the owner will support you to resolve those problems as well in case if it is not resolved by your internal team or uh, other service offering team so service offering means very simple we are giving a commitment to the uh, requesters or a business uh, i am available for 99.9% 24 bar 7 basis so i am just giving some offering uh, for this uh, area so giving a commitment 
So once the commitment is fulfilled, the service offering we are also following the SLAs. Is it followed properly? Or because I committed ninety nine point nine percent, I am available. But uh, what is the real time uh, availability? So those area also we can define the SLA. So uh, some terminology is completely repeated. Logic is little same, but the terminology is little different. So portfolio. Anyway, you have already studied in your strategic portfolio management. What is portfolio meaning? Or a project portfolio management, uh, you have studied like what is a portfolio meaning? Taxonomy, you already studied in your employee central portal how it will work. Services and service offering. Earlier, you have studied with the help of just catalog driven catalog approach. But the, here specifically, they build this is a service and this is a service offering like that. So everything it is a known item. but when you talk about this uh, module based activity they have a, they have introduced service now they have introduced uh, terminology name those terminology you should be very careful so that you can handle it but other than this everything you already know this information but when you see a real time demo you will get more clarity i can showcase you in this session please subscribe and stay tuned so that uh, you will learn more in this uh, service portfolio management area and uh, when i talk a discussion so that time i highlighted there is a relationship with your csdm so see here this is a, a version 4 uh, there is a sell and consume uh, area you can see the business service offering business services request catalog item business consumes so those <coughs> sorry <coughs> those area it can be derived with the help of service portfolio and digital portfolio management and uh, you can see the differentiation managed by and used by Uh, these these are all the things it is managed by and used by its application services so technical services technical offering so there there is a relationship with with your uh, business services so mainly we are focusing for this business services in your uh, service portfolio management and digital portfolio management this is uh, diagrammatic representation number 1 diagrammatic representation number 2 this is a csdm relationship uh, to bar 2 that is a version 5 in this version 5 also clearly highlighted it here it, it was highlighted as a sell and consume here it is a service consume uh, consumption so in the service consumption clearly highlighted as a business services and business service offering this area your service portfolio management or digital portfolio management will help you if you are implementing this solution you are completely aligning a csdm framework as well so it's pretty important uh, if you are little matured with your cmdb area and your ticket area then you please position this solution it will bring the magic in your landscape so this is a conceptual to physical model relationship it is completely uh, uh, available from the service now order box uh, criteria uh, what table it having a relationship with what table that source and target table relationship it's clearly highlighted in this diagrammatic representation specifically we are talking about this service portfolio management side so service and digital portfolio management uh, what type of relationship it having means i just clearly indicated in this arrow mark there is a service portfolio business services business services uh, having a relationship with your service offering and the service offering it is relationship with your application services so these <coughs> relationship it is pretty much important to learn the item uh, in the business landscape so i can showcase you in the uh, in the Uh, configuration portion so you will easily connect this item uh, yeah so demo practical uh, discussion stay tuned in this channel we will discuss this item in the next video i hope you enjoyed this session uh, if you want to learn a service now niche topic very simple and easy manner this channel will help you please subscribe and stay tuned thanks for your time good day and goodbye